And who might you be? Ah, oh, you are a pirate. How exciting. Back home, we never see such diverting costumes at court. Avery has, of course, sent you to spur me to negotiations. I fear it cannot be. I have received a summons to return to the royal court for an important social occasion. Ah, the burden of nobility. But wait, perhaps there is a solution. My dear nephew, Lipizzano, a member of my entourage, might go back in my place. It could work. But he is embroiled in some imbroglio with the war threats. I know nothing of it. My aide, Bardigiano, can tell you more. He is shopping. Ah, Lipizzano. Yes, he had an uh, interesting time in Scrimshaw. I can tell you where he is, but could you help me first? This strangely trustworthy art dealer has a priceless vase from an ancient Mushu dynasty, and he is offering it for an incredibly low price. It would be a perfect gift for my betrothed. Alas, my daily stipend is depleted. Could you, uh, purchase it for me? <laughs> Only 200 gold coins. 200 gold? Are you serious? Let's go tell the Count this fool won't help us find Lipizzano. No, wait! You want your Captain Avery's negotiations to succeed, yes? And how can you turn your back on true love? Greatest of all causes. Oh, dash it all. Let's do it, then. But this had better be the end of it. Ah, well chosen. That's a priceless vase, that is. I'm a fool to let it go for so little. We're clearly getting swindled, but if it gets a job done for Captain Avery, I'd say it's worth it. Grazie. Oh, this means so much to me. I will find a way to repay you. Of course I will. Now for Lipizzano. I will be happy to accompany him back home to Valencia, but you will have to convince him to leave. He is in a uh, tavern down the way. You can find him there. And who's this, then? Friends of yours, your noble ship? <laughs> Please, you must help me. These rats are madmen. Madmen? No, just businessmen. And you, my good sir, owe us quite a bit of money. Maybe your friend here can balance accounts. Oh, no, you don't. We've had quite enough of this. Get them!
all right. I'll admit our dealings weren't entirely honest. Take that unicorn away. We'd best not see him again. Many thanks, Captain. Now please, get me out of here. My thanks, Captain. You have saved me from a long trip home. So, my nephew, I trust you have learned to be careful in cities such as this? Oh, yes, my uncle. I will be happy to never see this place again. I thought so. Very well. Captain, I shall sail with you to your Captain Avery immediately. Let us go. At last, our discussions can begin. Oh, I cannot wait to dive into the intricacies of trade agreements and mutual defense pacts. Captain, you've done well. My guests will no doubt need some time to settle in, and I expect our discussions will be long indeed. If I could ask another favor of you, please come visit from time to time and see if there's anything you can do to keep our guests comfortable. Mm.